what's going on YouTube? Today we're gonna to be taking these red Air Force Ones and we're gonna be turning them into a pair of red Air Force One with a black paint drip. First thing we're gonna do is grab some acetone and cotton balls and we're gonna strip down the factory finish of the areas that we're gonna be airbrushing. After we're done properly stripping down the areas, we're gonna get some painter's tape and we're gonna tape around the Nike swoosh. After we get the areas taped around the Nike swoosh, we're gonna grab our drip decal and our transfer tape, and we're gonna put this drip decal onto the Nike Air Force Ones. You wanna make sure that you take your time putting the decal on. You don't wanna leave any air pockets under the decal after you take the transfer tape off. After we get the decal laid down on the Air Force One nice and tight down to the leather, we're gonna tape all the way around the drip decal that we just put on. After you get done taping around the decal, you're gonna wanna tape up the rest of the shoe just to ensure that you don't get any airbrush spray on any other part of the shoe that you don't want. I'm gonna be using Opaque Black from Jacquard to airbrush the drips on this Air Force One. You wanna start off and end with very light coats when you're airbrushing this drip on the shoes. Jacquard airbrush paints are very easy to use right out of the bottle. Acrylic airbrush paint. As you can see, after a few light coats with the opaque colors from Jacquard, you can get a solid fill. If you haven't already, like, comment, subscribe, and hit the bell notification to stay in the loop on any new videos we drop. One of the last steps for this custom is to seal the paint drip. I like to use a matte finish from Liquid Kicks. This stuff dries up and it's nice and smooth, just like a factory finish. And finally, all we gotta do to finish up this custom is take these red laces out and swap them out for a black pair. And also replace the original all red Air Force One tags that came with the Air Force Ones and take them out and replace them with a chrome silver pair. I'll leave a link in the description in case you're interested in purchasing a new pair of Air Force One tags for yourself. I'll leave a link for the drip decals as well. If you haven't already, like, comment, and subscribe. It would tremendously help my channel on my journey to 1,000 subscribers. sneakervinyl.com